And this morning we're checking out what's made in Wisconsin. Pauline Lee is learning how Scray Cheese makes its famous mm. cheese curds this mm. morning. Hi, Pauline. Looking good. good. Fresh cheese curds are flying. I know, right, Rachel? I've got my hairnet on. I've got my gloves on. We're talking about cheese curds here at Scray Cheese. Let's stop the process a little bit here. I'm here with Ryan, fourth generation Scray family. And so he is... You're in charge. You're kind of in charge of, you know, making all the cheese products, right? Absolutely. Oh, man. So this is a very big tub of cheese curds. How much cheese curds are you making today? Uh, four to 5,000 pounds we'll make today. Oh, my gosh. So how long does it take to make cheese curds? It takes around five hours from the time we start pouring milk till we can take it out of the vat. Okay, so uh, what is that? how does it work? Five hours, what do you do? Uh, for the first hour, we put in the milk. Yep. Uh, uh, during that process, we put it in the cultures, uh, specifically made for cheddar, to start the cheddar process. And then after the vat is filled, we fill uh, uh, with rennet. We add the rennet to the milk to coagulate the milk to start the whole cheese process uh, to where it starts looking like cheese. Okay. After uh, we uh, coagulate the milk, we cut it all into small little slices, then we drain it. Uh -huh. uh, drain the, all the way out of the vat so it presses up. Uh, put it in a small slab, start flipping it, called the cheddar process. That's where you see the small slab that I threw it through. Oh, we that do right that there. for about 45 minutes. Yeah. Oh. And uh, we the shorten our time. All our cheese curds are made just for cheese curds, no cheddar. Yeah. So we don't let the acid run out higher than most factories, because most factories make cheddar with their cheese curds. Mm. So now so then you cut them? Make, yeah, and then after we make, uh, after we, we uh, mat the cheese in the cheddaring process, yeah. We mill the cheese curds into small cheese curds, what you see in your bags today. And what's happening right now? Is this salt? Uh, after we mill the cheese curds, we start adding salt. Got it. Um, we add the salt to the last process. We break up all the chunks, and then we bag it and, and put it in tubs. All right. So Ryan saved two slabs of cheese for me. Will you teach me how to do this? Absolutely. <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right. So what do I do? It's going to get a little loud, so we're going to try and do our best here. Okay. It's all right. What do I do now? Well, you grab one of those slabs and try throwing it through them. <laughs> oh, it's a heavy slab of cheese. Oh, oh this is cool. cool. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. Oh, wait. Oh, there we go. Okay. Look at that. If I ever want to go into cheese making, I think I could do it. Yep. Yeah. We're going to explore more here at coming up. Okay. Thanks, Pauline. Perfect. Very good. <laughs> Perfect. I was worried about her fingers, though.